Hi, it's Aunt Nanny. We're going to read a book today, Care Bears, The Day Nobody Shared, by Nancy Parent, illustrated by Jay Johnson. One day, Good Luck Bear got a box of rainbow bars in the mail. He decided to hide the treat so he could have them all to himself. Hello, said Share Bear. What are you doing? I'm hiding my rainbow bars so I don't have to share them, Good Luck Bear whispered. But it feels so good to share, said Share Bear. It does, asked Good Luck Bear. Come for a ride on the swings, said Share Bear. I'll tell you a story called The Day Nobody Shared. Once upon a time, Chair Bear made a giant ice cream sundae with rainbow sprinkles that she wouldn't share with any of her friends. Chair, Chair Bear ended up with an awful tummy ache from eating the ice cream all by herself. Then Bedtime Bear refused to share his special spot to watch the Carolot Parade. But without Grumpy Bear to keep him awake, Bedtime Bear fell asleep and missed the whole thing. That afternoon, Tenderheart Bear wouldn't share his toys, so nobody wanted to play with him. Tenderheart Bear quickly got bored. Toys don't laugh and talk like friends, he said unhappily. And when Love a Lot Bear wouldn't share her kite with Sunshine Bear, he went and played with Wish Bear instead. What bad luck that no one wanted to share, said Good Luck Bear. That's right, said Share Bear. If I share my rainbow bars, Good Luck Bear asked, will that make everyone happy? Yes, said Share Bear. Sharing takes happiness and spreads it around. Sweetness goes a long way, if you're willing to share. I want to share these rainbow bars with our friends right now, said Good Luck Bear. Great idea, Share Bear replied. We can throw a sharing party in the park. When they passed Share Bear's house, Share Bear ran inside and came out with a bunch of balloons. I'm going to share these, said Share Bear. It feels really great to share, said Good Luck Bear. And it tastes yummy too, said Share Bear. And that was it, the end. If you like that book, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And make sure you check back often, because you never know what Aunt Minnie is going to read next. Toodaloo!